the word theory can be used to mean something speculative and tentative. In everyday speech, it probably usually is used in that sense. Scientists very often use it in a much more positive sense. I think the easiest way is to use the ordinary language word fact. In the ordinary language sense of the word fact, evolution is a fact. The evidence that makes it a fact is partly fossil evidence, uh, partly compar comparative evidence, looking at modern species and comparing their bones, their organs, their structures generally, and especially their molecules, their genes, at a molecular level. This is extremely persuasive and powerful evidence. You compare the, uh, the genes of animals and plants, you find that they, the pattern of resemblance is a tree, a branching tree, and that branching tree could only be a family tree. Other very persuasive evidence is the, ge the geographical distribution of animals and plants on islands and continents. They are exactly where we should expect them to be if evolution were a fact. Mm -hmm.